Hey, what's up? It's Matt Cornett, and I'm hanging with J14. Whose tent do EJ and Nini have their first kiss in theater camp at? Whose tent? Is it EJ's tent? Nini's tent? Is it the electrical guy's tent? It's that electrical guy's tent, isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, 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 um. Yeah, uh, blah, 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 blah. I don't remember. What's the first letter? Uh, uh, it's it's a really it's a really great name. I remember it, but I clearly don't. So, Shinny, Shiggy, Shiggy. Yeah. I knew it was like something Y at the end. Yes, Shiggy, Shiggy, the tall guy that hangs the lights. All right. Whose tent is this? Uh, Shiggy, the tall guy who hangs the lights. Oh right, real quiet, never speaks. Yeah, it's called rolling electrocutions. <laughs> What did EJ do to get Nini the lead as Mary and the Librarian? So EJ uh, put a uh, mildly bad deviled egg uh, in uh, Emily Pratt's food, I guess. He, he gave her a bad deviled egg and it made her sick and it got uh, Nini the lead as Mary and the Librarian. You were responsible for Emily Pratt spending opening night with her head in the toilet? I believed in you. Answer the question. Okay, take it down a notch. I slipped her a bad deviled egg. I didn't think it would actually work. You got to play the lead, didn't you? Was that gonna happen if I hadn't stepped in? What note does Miss Jen give to EJ for why he didn't get the role of Troy? A lack of emotional connection to the material. I don't know why. I mean, come on, EJ, you saw when he has the interaction with Carlos, all the, all the emotional connection to the material. No, they were, they were, re no, they weren't real. They were, they were I just they were like a menthol stick that uh, one of our, our hair and makeup ladies like blows into your eye with and it creates. So I guess technically they're real tears, just not from a real place of, yeah. <laughs> Classic Troy on paper. <laughs> Lacks emotional connection to the material. Who says junior year, baby, on my girl mustache? Uh, I think he, I think he says, can you hear a baby on my little mustache? Might do a lot of things. Uh, it is Big Red, Larry Saperstein says that. It's happening. Hell yeah. Junior year, baby. My girl mustache. Might do a lot of things. Who does Nini think stole her phone? Uh, I believe she thinks it's Gina at first, right? Yeah, because Gina, did Gina steal something else? I don't remember. I know she thinks it's Gina, so she steals a bunch of Gina stuff back. And then shows EJ and makes EJ feel even worse than he already did. Okay, is it just me, or is it possible that Gina stole my phone? She schedules an early rehearsal that she knows I'll miss, and then shows up with a whole new dance number featuring her freakish rhythmic gymnastic skills that she knows I can't do. What sound does Big Red play instead of the fireworks during the show? Oh goodness! Oh good! Oh, uh, it's a scoreboard sound, isn't it? Yes, like. It is it, is it like a scoreboard buzzer? Yes, okay, yeah, yeah, that's it. Sounds like the fireworks have started. Can you hear them? Uh, uh, fireworks, fireworks. <laughs> what does Nini do when she gets nervous? She does a vague British accent. Not just a British accent, a vague British accent. Hey, I could really use some last minute tips, like now. Hey, you're doing the thing. What thing? The thing where you talk in a vague British accent when you get nervous. What possible theater venue was turned into a giant Starbucks? Uh, the Lucky Ducky Puppet Pavilion, is that what it was? <laughs> yes. I remember, so I had that line, and I specifically remember in the uh, in the table read, right, when we got the script, I went up to, uh, to Tim and I was like, and literally every single time I've said this, I've gotten tongue-tied and he's like, no, it'd be great. Just do it. In the table read, I don't think I got it out clearly once. I think we got one take when we filmed it of me actually getting it out like clearly. Like try to say Lucky Ducky Puppet Pavilion five times fast, even though I just said it perfectly. But like try to say it five times fast. It's very hard. <laughs> Ducky Puppet Pavilion, Lucky Ducky Puppet Pavilion, Lucky Ducky Puppet Pavilion. What? All right. Well, where was this version of my literature, is, is it even literature? I don't know, next question. <laughs> uh, what about the old Kingston downtown? It's condemned. Uh, the, the Lucky Ducky Puppet Pavilion? It's a massive Starbucks now. Whose red tie does Miss Darvis compliment at 
auditions. Red tie. Does Miss Darvis compliment? I want to say, I feel like it's not this, but I want to say I remember Kelsey wearing a red tie, but it's not Kelsey. I don't even remember. Is it? It's not Gabriella. She doesn't wear a red tie, does she? No. I don't remember. Alan, right. Who's Alan again? <laughs> Yeah, I, do, I don't I don't remember that. I do remember now that I remember like sitting in the chair and having to, you know, Google it. Um, but yeah, interesting. Whose red tie does Miss Darvis compliment at auditions? Oh, oh it's on the oh, oh, it's oh, Alan? Yes. Hey, EJ! I looked it up on my phone, you guys. I can't stop cheating, I'm sorry. What did Nini say after Ricky puked on her shoe shoes? What did Nini say after Ricky puked on her shoes in seventh grade after writing Demon's Destiny at Six Flags? What did Nini say after Rick? I don't remember. I all I for some reason what popped into my head is saying that's real. That's not realistic at the screen. Whenever Ricky, I guess, went to a musical with Nini, he said that's not realistic. But I don't. I don't remember what he or what she says. Right. Yes. 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 Okay. And then I puked all over your <laughs> shoes, and you didn't even make me feel bad about it. No, you just said, um... No worries. I've been wanting to get rid of these shoes for a while. Yeah, because you outgrew them. What does Carlos tell Seb before he goes on stage? Um, oh, 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 I can literally picture this. I can literally picture it. Uh, it's something like you were, you were made for this or you were born for this or something like that, right? Ish, you were... You were born for this moment. You were, oh, I don't get, wait, can you give me a, like a hint? Count your blessings and, oh gosh, I don't remember. Hand your heart out, yes. I don't want to let them down. Seth, count your blessings and dance your heart out. Honestly, I'm shocked at how well I did. Um, but then again, I feel like the two hardest ones were those last two and I didn't get them, so. Um, I, there are a few things that I am shocked that I remember, but also I'm, you know, I'm a huge fan of the show. So I watched it once when it first came out, like myself, and then I rewatched the whole thing with my family. And then just like here and there for different things, I, I watch different episodes with people. Um, but yeah, probably more than I'd like to admit, but I, I love the show. I'm a fan. High School Musical, the musical, this series, season two premieres on Disney Plus Friday, May 14th.